The National Financial Literacy Strategy is a national framework for action for all those concerned with improving the financial literacy of Australians, led and coordinated by ASIC. The strategy is built around a number of specific priorities, including educating the next generation through the formal education sector, and increasing the use of free and impartial sources of information and guidance for all Australians. The strategy is a culmination of about 12 months of consultation with key stakeholders. ASIC spoke with over 200 stakeholders in developing the strategy from government, community, business and education sectors. The strategy also reflects consumer and investor research, international best practice guidelines and advice from the Australian Government Financial Literacy Board. Our role is to lead and coordinate the National Financial Literacy Strategy, which is consistent with our statutory objective to promote confident and informed consumers in the financial system. As the Financial Conduct Regulator, ASIC has unique insights into the issues facing consumers and investors that may require financial literacy or an investor education response. ASIC also runs its own strategic program of financial literacy initiatives. One flagship initiative is ASIC's Money Smart website at moneysmart.gov.au and also ASIC's Money Smart teaching program designed to promote and support financial literacy in schools. These days, almost every Australian is a financial consumer or an investor, having a credit card, a bank account, a superannuation account or an insurance policy. This means that we're making more financial decisions in an ever-increasingly complex world than, than ever before. So financial literacy, or the ability to make informed financial decisions that support your own financial well-being, is increasingly an essential life skill for all Australians. On the one hand, having good financial literacy is important for everybody, regardless of your age, your income or your personal circumstances, because the ability to manage your money well and make good financial decisions that are in your own interests is an important skill that everybody needs. On the other hand, we know that there are groups in the community that have lower levels of financial literacy compared to the general population, or there may be issues that mean they require more support in terms of financial literacy. And these include young people, women, pre-retirees, retirees, and those with lower levels of formal education. 